And move on now to the next story. This one is from Friday's Mail uh, with uh, why even when the cameras have stopped rolling, you really do need to be careful yeah. what you say with a mic on, Leo, and I'm saying that to you specifically. Yeah. No, the way I'm... you speak when you're off air. No, it's yeah, no, on air is the problem On air is the problem yeah. with Leo. Although, yeah, yeah. Uh, I do sometimes stop speaking, Josh. But, um, yeah, Tory MP <laughs> Steve Baker uh, hopes Krishnan Guru Murthy is sacked and says it would be a service to the public as Channel 4 suspends the presenter for a week after calling the minister... Uh, C, a C no, word? C just, you, just leave it at that. See you next Tuesday, uh, off camera. I think, I think you say see you next Tuesday. Um, so, yeah, they apparently breached the Channel 4 code of conduct, which yes. is to, to keep your biases, your left-wing bias, hidden. And uh, so he revealed <laughs> it. He revealed it. And, uh, uh, but, but, sorry, I have to ask, Leo, yeah. because no-one was in any doubt, really, that, uh, of Channel 4 News' bias. I mean, that would be hilarious. That's like pretending that The Guardian doesn't have a bias. Yeah. You know, I mean, so, you know, you remember when they did the coverage of the, the last election? I mean, it was so partisan. Yeah. So, th- so this is no big secret, is it? I think, isn't it just the language that's the problem, Josh? All right, can I say something? This is the Howie hot take, yeah. right? Okay. It's got nothing to do with bias. He didn't pre... pre- Pre-case it with, um, you know, Tory, see or whatever like that. Yeah. He basically, they had an argument. He's now this guy um, called him. Basically, said he was a stupid question. And what he did, he first of all, he vent, number one, he invented off air. Right, that's yes. the big thing. Yes. Number two is it's a great word. <laughs> Love it. One of my favourite <laughs> words. And number three is they had an argument, and he said. Uh, where he basically said he accused him of being stupid or said it was a stupid question. And afterwards, he then went, no, it wasn't a stupid question. Oh, God, he's such a whatever. Well, actually, we can hear the recording. We have bleeped it, by the way, but let's hear what we've got. Steve Baker, thank you very much indeed. Thanks a lot, Steve. It wasn't a stupid question, Steve. You know it. I'm very happy to go up against you on trust any day. (laughs) <laughs> what a <laughs> I mean, it sounds almost like, from that, it sounds like it was banter, almost. And, yeah. Well, it sounds like he's actually talking to him when he says it. It's not like he's yeah. turned away and is just saying it to, to his, yeah. you know... Uh, Steve! Steve, <laughs> Steve, one last thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But that but, but, didn't but go out live, did it? It just went out on the feeds, which is... But, it went, but it went out on the feeds, which means that other people are going well, to pick didn't, it up. Uh, yeah, that... And, Josh, isn't it the case, though, that... I mean, broadcasters, you know, always have to be aware that they're wearing microphones. They have yeah. to be professional. yeah. And really, when you're a news broadcaster, you really do want to keep your... Absolutely, but it sounds. But the point is, this has been presented as a narrative of, like, look at him, he's a big lefty. Now, he may well be, right? But this isn't what he... It's not like some... The usual diatribe by some lefty, oh, Tories, oh, I hate Tories, and all that stuff. This is him... This is a it's personal... It's a bit worse than that. It's a, <laughs> it's, but it's a personal thing about the, the way that they, they're, they're conversation. So for you, it's not really... The, the language, the extremity of the language in and of itself is not sufficient, you don't think, to well, be Well, OK, but that's the argument, what it should be. What people are trying to make it... Leo and some people who are on the TV before are trying to make it all about bias, and it's not about bias. You can argue that he shouldn't be using that particular language, fine, but it doesn't prove that he's, like, biased in and of itself. Does it matter so much? I mean, if it were the state broadcaster, it would matter more, wouldn't it? They basically are a state broadcaster. I mean, they're, they're funded with public money, I believe, they are, yeah, and, yeah. Uh, and they're, they've got to abide by, you know, public sector broadcasting rules yeah. uh, and Ofcom as well. You know, they're, they're effectively uh, another, another BBC. And, yeah, I mean, we've seen other people brought down by this. Gordon Brown was brought down by Hot Mike when he went away yeah. from that Sky interview yes. and called someone a, a, a racist. Um, yeah, just because they. Bigoted. Bigoted. Well, I thought yeah. he said big because she had big boobs. <laughs> no, no, no. So, no, it was bigot. But then oh, on the okay. other hand, people keep mispronouncing Jeremy Hunt's name and getting away with it on, on radio during the day or TV yeah. during yeah. the day. It's, it's a, a hard word to pronounce. <laughs>